I was born ready. What's up, nerds? We're back. I didn't read that. I thought you did it last episode. Nope, I didn't. I well, stopped you, specifically. You should have. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. <laughs> but you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Popkins <laughs> and his loft wing share a special connection. Right? It, you know, I was just thinking, I was like, usually when they have your name in it, it's like, uh, it's in it's like, blue. Yeah. It's been blue yeah, before. It's, like, it's like highlighted. Yeah. I've never seen anything quite like it. Most people are real shit to their birds. Like, honestly, it makes it feel more like his name's actually Popkins. Yeah. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. A pair of birds. We only made whole by our loft wings. Oh, it's like Avatar. Yeah, it's like Avatar. The guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. And we're gonna shove our weird hair, hair penises into their hair penises. Yep. Oh, when we're young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. You just get a free bird for living here? Huh, it's quite dude. a big moment. I'm sure you recall. Yeah, it's like how the uh, the fairy folk get their fairy. Yeah, the Koroks oh, get their fairies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but that first meeting between Popkins and his loft wings was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson loft wing. Its breed so rare we were sure for some time it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seem to share a profound connection from the mo- Hopkins, pay attention. <laughs> God, quit fucking- so I'm talking to you. <laughs> Stop staring at each other. Do you other. recall when Popkins and that loft wing first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. Well, they really keep this camera. I know, right? Face. And how, judging by how She's jealous, not even talking. I know. <laughs> Look at her; her mouth just like moving, just like. Yeah. <laughs> wow! Friendship. All right, all right, all right, all right. Ted, you, you ready me to blow your mind? Look at how fast her eyes are vibrating. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, oh man! It totally freaks you out, right? Just, she's just this, <laughs> right. She's just gyrating profusely in the eyeballs, with her mouth just slowly going. Like her head's moving normal, but those eyes just are just like ping pong yep. and didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. With those twitchy eyes, you see everything. This is eyes. Oh, uh, can tell. No, his eyes don't twitch. Nope, she just got problems. Ah, uh, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful <laughs> bond shared by Popkins and his bird. This guy, Pippet, that guy really yells at me every day. Right, that this. guy's really weird. We kind of stay away from Pippet, but damn, can he fly? He's going. Uh, technically, I should be allowed to ride any bird that I want, and I'm like, leave him alone, it's his bird. And Popkins, stay away from the birdness. <laughs> stay away from, I don't know what bird housing is called. Aviary? An aviary. Stay away from the aviary. Sooner or later, hoo-hoo! See, you want hoo-hoo, because he's an owl. Nice. This contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. The ceremony is part okay. of the final <laughs> test for those training to become Knights of Skylar. Oh, you sound just like your dad. <laughs> Sometimes I know you're my daughter. <laughs> if Popkins doesn't fly fast enough during the race, that rapist what's his name's gonna make me do it. What? If oh, it comes up later. He's he's tall. He's Biff. Uh, what if Popkins messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a nyot? Your eyes stop vibrating. That's good. Calm down, my dear. It'll be fine. I can tell your eyes have stopped vibrating. You must be really freaked out to focus on one thing. 
Honestly, it's almost as though you the become a completely scanning. different person when you're worried about sandwiches. <laughs> Hey, Popkins, listen! Couldn't fly hard out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze a little practice time before the race. Oh, those kids. <laughs> listen, you gotta practice <laughs> hard out today, or at least squeeze yeah. a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Just do something with that heart yeah. of yours. <laughs> you'll, be get, you'll get spare soon, don't yeah. worry about it. Come on, you'll thank me later. Here we go, go ahead and jump off the edge. Call your Loughling, it's almost time for the ceremony. Just try just to be serious for once. Hmm? Oh yeah, you can't sense your bird out there? <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> oh, I get it, you're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go, <gasps> to your doom! Okay, Popkins, go ahead Damn. and just press down on your lock to call your Loughling. I didn't press down. Yeah, no. I wanted to see what happened. Mm -hmm. Hmm. This bird sure has taken a long time <laughs> to get here. <laughs> Something's wrong. You see, her loft wing is blue. It's purple. Oh. Violet, I guess. Hang in there, Popkin. Hang in there, Popkin. <laughs> <laughs> I should really read who it's talking before I talk. <laughs> Are you two all right? Please don't throw me off of uh, islands again. <laughs> I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? I Wing. am going to kick the shit out of that guy later. I legit thought she was talking to me until yeah. she said wing. I was like, oh, I'm fine. Oh, wait a minute. This is very odd, Popkins. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? I know you almost just died, but uh, for a bird to ignore the call of its master, it's unheard of. Hmm. Because it didn't hear you, get it? Oh. And you still can't <laughs> sense your bird guy. nearby, Popkins. This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony yeah, yeah, is about to highlighted. start. The wing ceremony. Popkins, when you said you couldn't... S damn it. <laughs> when you said you <laughs> couldn't send your offering, well, I shouldn't believe you. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 right, they're going to get them both <laughs> off screen. I know they're related, but jeez. Thank you. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You pushed me off of this place. Right. You better go on ahead and see if you can find your bird. What your bird is gone. Where? <laughs> Lobo. 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 Lord Sadler. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing a Van Helsing thing, but you were doing one thing. Right, where'd everybody go? Bingo. Hey. Why? How did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Popkins! You should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay a race a little bit so you can find your beard. But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. But father. If Popkins, but father, but father, but father, but father, if Popkins asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Ah, oh, quite true as usual. You make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself. A long run and tell Instructor Horwell to come and see me in my quarters. Where does that water come from? It's clouds. Rains and shit. Clouds. Clouds. Hopkins, I'm going to tend to my bird. Make sure he's not hurt. I'll catch up with you later. Well, maybe, you know, you deserve it. <laughs> Go ahead and see if anyone knows what happens to your Loftwing. Get you. Do you get to name your Loftwing? No, you don't. <laughs> 
Are you back here, Laughling? He's not. Do you not remember where he is? No. Oh. He's in that... He's past that cave they just showed you for that whole scene. Oh. But... He wants to talk to me. Don't worry, Popkins. I'll be sure to explain your predicament to Instructor Howell. Go find him. Yeah, go find him, sir. Down the south of Skyloft, that plaza with X. Yeah. Thus plaza. Litter. Wow. Actually, didn't. Uh, Alora, please stop licking my leg. <laughs> Isn't it cool that the water's animated on the map? Isn't that fun? That is fun. I didn't realize that. Bird statue. It's pronounced beard. Statue. Need to get to me. Sparing hole. Alright. Mm. Have you read a map before? You've had one your entire fucking life. Yeah. What is it? You, you gotta hit the minus button to open the map. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Now you can zoom in on various parts of the meow. And I can't jump off there. I'll just uh, die. No, you won't die. You'll get a talking... You'll get a stern talking to. Oh, I love a stern talking to. I'll jump off. And away we go! You'll find me this time, won't you? Watch your fucking step out there! <laughs> you can't always depend on likes like me to swoop in and save you! I 100% bet I can. Thank you, though. You can. They will never let you die. But they will keep- they will keep giving you talking tos. Now you gotta go... Back out and leave. Go talk to Horwell. The opening of Skyward Sword is a lot of running around. I have to go talk to Horwell. Is he still back in that one place? Yeah, he should be. No, stop licking my hands. Okay. <laughs> I'm talking to my dog, by the way, guys. <laughs> what if I was like, Ted, wow, stop you're... licking my hands. She's Alex, really gross. Your hand is glistening with dog slobber. <laughs> Eh, hey, what? What? Your loft wing is missing? How strange and troubling. Do you think you can find him? I just realized a lot of these adults don't have eyeballs. They're just empty black slits. Yeah, but he at least looks like his eyes are closed. Because he's not blinking profusely like the other guy. The other guy... He just blinked profusely. He's not blinking. Oh, well, my God, that's terrifying. See, I told that's you. It's, worse. I know, because his eyes are, like, right yeah, there. This game isn't meant to be in HD. <laughs> they look like little mouths. are like... Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> like from, uh... What, what's it called? Uh... Dream. Yeah, um... Sandman. Yeah, Sandman. Or the Sandman. Like, nah, 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 nah. I see. So the headmaster summoned me. All right, then I'll go speak with him immediately. Give me a bite. <laughs> I stole you for helping me find out or for helping me out earlier. So don't worry about the ceremony for now. You can focus on finding your loft wing. That's how this business works. It's respect. You take care of me. I take care of you, and you stay the fuck away from Biff. This door open yet? No, you gotta go get a sword. Really? I'm pretty sure. Is something wrong? What's the big hurry? What? Your laugh wing is missing? But I just saw him. Bruce's bird was chasing off after your feathered fellow. It's that son of a bitch. Oh, Bruce? He and his little cronies were saying they were headed down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. So my guess is they might be in the plaza. Normally, the fastest way is just down this path. But this gate here still needs some work before I'll open it. Can you go around to the academy? Remember to check the map. Okay, so I can't go that way. No, you, see, you just go through there. But if you go the other way, you might be able to go get a sword. I don't either. You'll have to come back here and get a sword after you talk to Bruce, or you can get the sword now. I don't remember if you can get the sword now. But you go to that sparring hall and you get your sword. 
That's one ugly kid. Yeah, look at him. Fucking piece of shit. Oh, Brian. Hey, Brian. Can you help me with something? All you gotta do is dash and roll into a tree. You can get my thing out of the tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, and then you're in front of a tree. Bam! Do a roll right into it. So come up, please. Oh, for golly. That was unintelligible. <laughs> While dashing, shake the wee- the- I know, right? I should- I might have to use the correct color Joy-Con just to help me, you know. You did it! Cast that I love you! Wait up, I'm gonna catch you and put you in his pants for later! Come to Gully! I thought he was gonna eat him. You eat it for later, maybe? Pants is pants! <laughs> Is there anyone else I should be talking to, or just the no. ugly child? So, uh, that's also something they added, is people who have, like, missions or something to say to you will have those bubbles over them. Ooh. Oh, this is the plaza, right? Yep. Oh, this is the cutscene, right? Yep. Stop beating up that guy! He's not even Stretch. doing anything! You know, Chris, that sure was a paid. What with all the scratching and packing. Well, wow, Alex, I've been doing a lot of the voices. Oh, okay. I just, I just pushed. I didn't realize it changed, actually. Close to the other, close it was. You thought a big crimson laughing like that was gonna go down without a fight? But we got him, and I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. See, he's straight up just Biff Tannen. And what's up with Rosie O'Donnell who kept rubbing his arm? They're weird, there's lackeys. Oh! And you're Marty McFly. Hopkins, uh, yeah, I just. How long have you been standing there? What's your problem anyway? Oh wait, I got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I guess you... I can see in those dopey eyes of yours, they're pleading, Oh gross, can you please find it in your huge strong heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda on your statue of the goddess. At the end of the ceremony. Bruce, what the fuck are you talking about? I hang out with Zelda all the time right. alone. We're I was literally, literally best just friends. alone with her two seconds ago. Whoa. Right? His eyes are yellow. They are. Well, sorry, pal. Bruce doesn't do charity for wimps. I only do charity for people with cancer and the elderly because I care about people. I care about my community, but only those who can help themselves or those who lack the ability to help themselves. You, you're just a lazy piece of shit. My advice, work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? Is it on my head? I can imagine what could have happened to it. Do you think his tiny brain nice got <laughs> confused in all the clouds? Nice hair. You lay off my do right now or I'll flatten you. Everyone knows I have the sickest pompadour in town. You know, you're getting real ta all tired of all never let forget and Zelda shit. Go way back. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can read it. Uh, you've been friends since you were kids. Big deal. It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the cloud. We're all in the clouds, dumb right? dumb. Would you wake up, straighten your and grow your backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. There's only like five people there, so really, I guess you really would bring down the average. And just who might you be talking about, Groos? Zelda, hey, nah, it's like, uh. I'm just gonna get. 
Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on sandwiches again, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> He's a student of the academy, like all of us. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? You're such a piece of shit. Yeah, I, I suppose. You suppose you're a piece of shit? I know it. You suppose? You suppose what? You piece of shit? Why are you steaming? I suppose you, uh... It's really creepy. Forget it, I was supposing anything, okay? How can you express that much heat and moisture out of your nose? <laughs> okay, we're out of here, boys. Later, pumpkins. I hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. Oh, also, your bird will totally starve to death and die. That could be a major setback to our nighthood, you know, if your bird fucking died. So find that bird or get rid used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. Also, dead bird. <laughs> They'll eat the loft wings. Well, they all have different colors, too. Mm -hmm. I hate to say it, but I'm getting to suspect that those blockheads... Really, you're just beginning to suspect? Mm -hmm. Hopkins, those guys aren't going to help us find your beard, so we better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can trace your beard. Father said he talked to the instructor Ho We were there together. We were both a part of that conversation. Yeah, you go Why are you telling me? Bird, yeah. The thing that I'm not allowed to do yet. All right, um, I guess you can climb up. Yeah, you do whatever you want. I don't give shit. Whatever, man. You do you. I'm just someone here, you know, whatever. Why does it get dim when I look up at the sun? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. So that cave over there is where you need to go. Okay. This is but you hole. Hole. Yeah, but you, you need you need I think like the lens of truth or some shit and uh to you know go inside. Give me money. Just jump off to the ground that's not there. Okay. Now I th now I'm pretty sure you need to go get a sword. <laughs> I mean, I guess you don't have to get a sword, oh, but... No, this guy wants to talk to me. You look, now he's got a bubble. What's wrong, Pop... He... Wrong, Popkins. What? Your loft wing's missing? You want to fight the ballots? <laughs> That's terrible. I was looking forward to seeing that red blur streak through the sky. No, no. I haven't seen him. Hmm. Why don't you look for him by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from there. Great, great big Yep, yep. I was just there. Yeah, I told, I told you, man. This opening is so much like running back and forth and back and forth. It's a whole ass thing. Hey, there's church just over there. Yeah, there's a lot of little church just everywhere. Ugly kid. Well, I want a stamina fruit. This, this isn't the academy. The building over here is right. No, so that's the academy. This is the uh, sparring round. Oh, it's those guys. Yeah. And then you talk to him, and then you talk to that dude, and he's like, hey. All right, they're doing it. The button. Hopkins, perfect timing. I heard your left wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join the search. And get this, when I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. So I beat the shit out of him. Look at the blood running down his pants. I'm so I'm sorry, Popkins. They made me do it. I can't really want to tell, but if Groose found out I told you, he'd fucking kill me. <laughs> it sounds like Groose forced him to keep quiet about it. He beat me so profusely. Go on, tell him the truth. Do it, you bitch. 
Just a little while ago, when I was cleaning dining hall, Gruus and his buddies came in. They ripped off patches of my cheeks and <laughs> just... <laughs> Look at the skin! It just... It in a perfect circle. It just stopped bleeding. They burned me with irons! <laughs> I wanted to warn you, but just as I tried to sneak away, they burned the other one! Who said this game grabbed me? And that's when they did the unspeakable things. I was... I wasn't this bashful until after this morning, wow, as I you all... I never ride a bird again. Jeez. Uh, yeah. They were gonna cut his butthole! <laughs> right on to... Sounds like Cruz and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Well, near a waterfall would mean... Quick, let's take a look at... Okay. Yes, but no, uh, no, no, no. Yes, look at the X. Yes, no, no, Jump over the stone. Oh. Forgive me, Poppy. Okay, so I can't help. You. Yes, you're a fucking coward. We all know. Look at you, Fledge. God. Oh, Aegis. Oh, he's like an eagle. Yep. <laughs> it's Poppin! So you still want to get this on wet? Practice? Even though today is the wing ceremony? Oh, I'm impressed. The sword is in the back room. Go back there and get it. I'll be here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling a sword, go ahead and ask. That's a great voice, man. Thank you. It's really good. It's a lot of swords. Yep. But I imagine I want this thing. A practice sword! It's a fairly sharp blade, Alex. A smollet. You can carry 300 bucks. Damn, Laura. She. Do you think that dog <laughs> snoring is coming on? I hope not. Right. I don't know. Just be quiet. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna be quiet for just a sec. <laughs> I don't think so. It's not coming up on the levels, but wow, that is some deep snoring. Oh my god, Alex, her eyes are freaking the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you'll do a side slash. Next, there's more advanced technique, the spin attack. It's the perfect move for when you're surrounded by enemies. If you remember these moves, you can handle yourself in any fight. Just remember the fundamentals. Always press the ZL to target an enemy as soon as you see it. Try getting in some good practice on those logs! If you forget how to swing your sword, you can always check the help with right button. And don't ever forget the fundamentals! They don't like it when you call them the help. Once you've sliced up those logs, I'll set it up so you can try out your big move! Bam. You gotta, you gotta. Boom. That's a pokey one. You gotta poke it. Oh. Isn't it funny there's a little keese on it? Yeah, that is funny. Uh, although I admit, I'm not too great at these. Jesus. Boom. Nice. Can you imagine playing this thing with the, the the joystick sword controls? Yeah, um, is it is it is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. It's like nigh impossible. Oh, it's pokey. That's right, Poppins. You really are a strong sword man. Easy to teach too. You make the rest instructor proud. You were ready to try a. Sp an attack! 
Great, now I'm going to surround you with logs. Use a spin attack to cut them all without moving from that spot. I've been caged. What? Oh, Boom. Good one. Hard. It sure Ow. looked like it felt good. So, why don't you try a fiddle blow to close out our session? Did you see a horse just like jump down and zonked out? Yeah. Fully? Yeah. All right. When your enemy is down, target with Zeno and throw yourself at it to land a fiddle blow. Do a side slash on that log, and when it's down, try finishing it off with this technique. Target ZL and shake. Stab! That's the way! A fatal blow is an effective move you should use right after you use your shield or a well placed spin attack to knock an enemy on its back. Oh, but monsters don't stay down for long, so you'll have to land that fatal blow quickly before they get up. You better remember how to do that fatal blow, because boy howdy, do they throw a lot of monsters at you with the expectation that you know how to just knock them out. Hey, Popkins, you can't take swords outside the sparring hall. What do you think you're doing sneaking out with that? What? Well? Your loft wing is missing? You want to go look for it? Well, I guess I can make an exception just this once. But remember that Sky Loft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. Knights and you, an untrained child. Right? So I don't want to see you swinging around out there. <laughs> it's out there. <laughs> I'm uh, pretty sure I will do that. I'm going to do that immediately. I don't each want you to get in a ton of trouble over this. So here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on these logs first. And once you get outside of that sword, only use it when you absolutely have to. Got it? Okay, I'll just run outside and start swinging it around. That's for the, I forgot, that's for the shield to parry. That's to learn how to parry. Oh, which I don't have. Yep. And I can't get. Stay nerdy! Stay nerdy! Kill him. <laughs> you wish to ride my bird? Ah! <laughs> Stay nerdy. Stay nerdy. <laughs> 